Hello, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide, and we are on November 29th, 2021. Welcome to another surviving day on the planet, and welcome to the Daily Dew, where we look at space weather, world weather, and earthquakes. Give you a quick update on our sun the last 48 hours, as it's been pretty active. Look at that large plasma filament, and that is an Earth-facing direction. We're going to be keeping an eye. ISWA has not updated just yet. Watching the outgoing activity there. Another close look at this large plasma filament that whipped away. Looks like it's in a more southern direction, but definitely in the position for an Earth-facing coronal mass ejection. ejection. Looking at the, the multi-spectrum here. You can see the plasma rope that was there just kind of lifted away ahead of that deepening coronal hole, which we can see here, that black region towards the southern hemisphere and the equator. And it's well, it is growing. So heads up, everybody. Going to be giving you an update later on, a full space weather update with the ISWA prediction spiral coming from this event. I'll give you a quick look at the last 24 hours for earthquakes as well. Started out the day with a large 6.3 earthquake, Izu Islands region. No tsunami was imminent from that event. There were at least four aftershocks through the region, ranging 4.4 to 4.7. And then across the ocean here to the North American plate, Mexico, La Libertad, saw four sizable earthquakes, ranging from 4.2 to 4.7 today, right in the Gulf of California. Minor earthquakes through California and all around. Just having a look at USGS today. And most of the activity has been right here in the Gulf of California. Right along the fault line. Four, five pretty sizable earthquakes. Looking at 223 earthquakes across the USGS map for the last 24 hours. Pretty widespread across North America. Minor activity. And then a closer look at exactly where... The 6.3 earthquake was Izu Islands. And that was right in the deep trench. 6.3. And as well, overlooking La Palma, saw a couple sizable earthquakes today. La Palma 5.0. And as well, east of that, towards Buena Vista, another 5.0 earthquake rang out. Let's have a quick look at the last 24 hours for all earthquakes. And you can see four pretty sizable earthquakes all around the island right now. Three or two on each coast and one down in the southern coast. La Palma volcano and as well one north. Many minor earthquakes all around the volcano. So heads up everybody and stay safe on the La Palma island in the canary islands as well i wanted to show you here with my radar satellite imagery across the world and precipitation that's all of the green here radar showing a massive atmospheric river that is heading towards bc right now and we've been talking about it for days so heads up stay safe stay aware and prepared and ready for quite possibly another state of emergency for British Columbia with all of this rain coming in and as well, Washington. So heads up, my friends, in the Pacific Northwest United States to Washington and Oregon and as well, British Columbia, my Canadian friends. This is a very big developing situation and not much has changed with the forecast here, but definitely giving you a show here pretty Large atmospheric river just south of Honolulu, running across the equator as well. Atmospheric river here on the east coast of North America through the Atlantic. One just east of that. We've got some very intense situations developing across the world right now. And it's evident. We are going through some kind of change. A lot of mainstream media is saying we're going through climate change. I tend to believe in climate cycles more than climate change i think we'd be going through this nonetheless i want to thank everybody for watching today this has been mike with your morning dew we have an atmospheric river stretching from taiwan to vancouver
Thanks for watching again. Stay safe, stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun. And get your morning due. Bye-bye now. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world.